A Vidicon is a television camera tube with a photoconductor target. The idea of Vidicon was offered by Chernyshev in 1925. There is an electric gun placed in a cylindrical pipe, which creates a small electron beam to focus and deviate an electron beam. In a Vidicon, electrostatic or magnet fields are used. One of the most significant parts of Vidicon is a photoconductor target containing a transparent metallic film with a photoconductive layer from the side of an electron optical system. Under the effect of light, a Vidicon target accumulates electric charges, changing the resistance of separate parts of the target and irregular, irregularly dispatching current potential in the same manner as of dispatching brightness of separate parts of the picture. An electron beam formed and deviated with magnet and electrostatic fields picks up these charges. There are a lot of various constructions of Vidicon targets. Some targets have two or three layers. Some have a mosaic structure with smooth and sponges layers. There also exist photoconductive and photodiode ones. As regards photoconductive targets, discharging depends on characteristics of a photoconductive layer and photo effect is rather inert. As regards photodiode targets, discharging depends on characteristics of electron hole junction, providing full division of light mediums and thereby zero lag, straight line relation of light characteristics, extreme high instrument sensitivity. Depending on a target, vidicons are divided into silicon vidicons, plumbicons, chalnicons, saticons, and so on. Vidicons are used in industrial television systems, where it is not required to transmit pictures of goers.